to 31. Those are the total rounds fought. That means that Velez. Go, la maravilla, Jason Bailey. Oh, California, here is the flash, Ryan Garcia. Keep your punches above this line. Shake hands. Good luck to both of you. He's got over 800,000 followers on Instagram. Let's go get warm real quick. <laughs> and as the rounds progress, I'll start doing what I'm the world title challenger. He said, I'll make my adjustment. Two rounds is going to be a, really a, a round of who going to dictate that up a position where they can go ahead and take deep. I want him to think. And Ryan Garcia is that aggressive and veteran move. He wants to start at the two. If you look at the back of Ryan Garcia, options from Ryan Garcia. Now he's got to make it not finished as a true prospect. And then I can once again because he's coming back with something. If he misses and he don't protect himself and just in the right distance to get a punch off, whether it's the right hand. Old boxing adage. Now you see the overhand. Jab up. That would make Valez become a... That's what he said. Let's see when I take his... Ready for round. Pro Korea's got six first round knockouts out of the third. The thing about Velez is he came to fight. He's got something. He came out and on opponents before. Uh, up. Velez wants to catch. Well, he's got Frida Kahlo. The gear. This is where Jason Velez is, is really in a way of, of keeping him off him, which is not going to be a good thing. Henry Garcia who's also his trainer. The other fighters, and that's something that you would like to see us. Ryan Garcia connects with a nice left. We might see Velez. Of a fighter, B-Hop. You've been there, done that. As the face once again, and there's a low blow from Velez. to suck him into a war. Ryan Garcia is in elite company with ESPN occupant from Puerto Rico, as well as Vasily Lom. Looking to prove that he belongs amongst those. Both of these fighters know how they got to win this fight, and also, but he got to throw more than one. And Valez know that head Garcia get frustrated, get tired. Yes, more combinations. He wants to see Ryan put three, four at a time. It's setting up a right uppercut or a left uppercut. At left hand or right hand, or Valez is going to run right in. Able to create space and try to take advantage. Ah, and that he can just do what he wants to do against left of Jason Velez. Go a little weak, and here comes her like Garcia has to figure out with that right uppercut that nice. I mentioned earlier. Looking at a fast food chicken place in Puerto Rico. And he still was training as he was working, anticipating that because he ended with an easy shot, that it's over. Sometimes puts undue pressure on a young fighter. But he's... Ryan Garcia tried to pull a Muhammad off. I mean, if you can back it up, it all makes it great. The language. Velez got hit with some good shots, and you know what? Punches can change your mind when they hit you impresses me about this young man is how he's able to create space structure for this round and Simalo smothered him get in front of Ryan he goes back to that maybe not right away but he goes back. A, a young fighter who believes in himself is a more experienced fighter with his 30 per 30 uh, uh, against a fighter of a lesser level I mean he Garcia is sitting in the pocket and he's continuing to throw him in the ring that's ring generalship when you see Ryan Garcia was supposed to be. Well, here he is, headlining on Golden Boy Boxing on ESPN. Up at the mouth. Expected to be in and to be taking Ryan Garcia in. So far, overhead. waiting to counter Valez. Like he just by round. How do he change Valez thinking and make Oxford trying to find a way to counter? All right, Beto, this. They start going to the body because they see how Valez is trying to get. Thank you very much to our ringside reporter, Beto Duran, and prospects, but. This was once the story of once that guy. I ended up working at a fast, and you know, we see Garcia as a guy that they can see right there. Another right hand that makes Velez's, Velez's observation of, he's got four losses, but he's always seen the final bell. And that's why. And he's here for a long time. And even though. Well, you see. Mexico, Puerto Rico on Cinco de Mayo weekend. Ringside, but look who's just a couple of seats Garcia does that too. So I'm yeah. sure Golden Boy Boxing is happy as one punch. I think he should add more punches because when he's go a long way, way past this fight. And, and Ryan Garcia, look at the guys who's going to maul you inside like he's doing now. It's also the fight that Jason Velez envisioned. I mean, he punishment. Let's take a look at the total ended. Almost twice as many for Ryan Garcia. 
Valencia himself round by round by round because Garcia is going to continue. Stop. Stop. Nice uppercut as Velez tried to get aggressive. Ryan Garcia having to think things through here and he lands on. You get hit with 10 punches and he takes that play away. Press forward and do something different or he's going to be. Other side, that's something that Bernard Hopkins would appreciate. So he's coming in like that, so you got to spin out immediately. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. And then open up. I'm a guy, a prospect like Garcia, he's going to him, but I doubt if he can withstand the speed. Is Jason oh, no, Velez and Sobeto, what were the assessment in the meetings that he knew that Ryan Garcia never got extra rep? Corner did a good job in terms of that, but there's that overhead of the face of Jason Velez. Pressure is just basically running into the throw punches as Velez walk in like he's doing now. Can do tonight, and nice left hook there. I make adjustments as the fight progresses. Not so much as well, a couple of rounds early up with maybe another right uppercut because he sees in the matador there in that scene where Velez was speed, power, and charisma. Ryan Garcia into deep waters. That's your specialty. What's it like when you succeed in doing what you came out to throw off a left hook and a left hook position? Feet. Important to be able to let him know that you yeah. this isn't no. deep water. All right, so. Ryan conditioned. I stopped working at the fast food place. I dedicated myself to forward that Ryan Garcia will have to deal with as Vela said the percentage at 28. He's got something. You got to change up from just hitting me with an uppercut. Throw a punch to make him pay. You make him miss, you make him pay. All right. Ryan Garcia with his back to the Our lightning quick. You can get away with from Garcia. It's like a whip when he throws it. Have been into deep waters, that is. <laughs> uh, but you know, Garcia has had no points, but both guys, even Valen. But I'm, I'm really pleased at Garcia. <laughs> Garcia is aware what he's doing, coming forward, rushing to the corner, and just let all his hands go like he tried to moving laterally, trying to get a little fancy. Dialistic boxing, they want a war. If Ryan Garcia rounds experience or you know he's not as talented all is in for a fight this evening what i like about Velez, ryan garcia never took a step back and get frustrated and that's what oh big right hand from ryan garcia the henry garcia his father's instruction they're happy with what they're seeing but there's no deals no life jacket no floaties this is coming to you from the StubHub Center in Carson. This prospect put in a workman-like. Must protect itself, and one shot could have changed everything. You know, Young, don't know, backs his hand, put his hands down back. Because this is a tough fight. I know what I have to do. StubHub Center, wearing overalls, and when I went into the locker room. At this stage of this young career, that he's... Type of fight, b that I think that you've got power. But I can take your shots. Is that we've seen knock other guys out or yep. down. It's an impressive performance, nonetheless, from Ryan Garcia. I have where he really gets to prove who he is. Ryan Garcia, a true group. If I was in his weight division. <laughs> the businessman, Bernard Hopkins, as this fight cut his performance here at the Stub Hop Center. But you have his punches just over 500 thrown, 150. Oh, yeah. The flash, Ryan Garcia.